See, that's why I tell people, bro. I'm glad. I am glad people took their time out and schooled me. People took their time out and put me on some chain gang shit, some street gang, you know, some, some jail gang, you no, know, some edu some some educated gang, you know what I'm saying, to help me better my life. Cause bro, I was lost. I'm not gonna lie. I was lost. But can you admit that you were lost? See that's the first step. That's the first step to everything. Like just like AA and everybody say, but you have to admit that you are at it. Like if you can't admit that you are wrong, then you will never be able to solve the problem. If you can't admit that, oh, I'm I'm wrong, I'm wrong for what I did, it's my bad, I would never be able to solve the problem. But we just gonna be arguing all day long. And we're gonna be arguing on who's wrong, who's right, and you would not be doing it. You feel me? And bro, and that's bro, that one thing like a lot of people cannot do. Like a, a lot of people cannot just admit that they're wrong. A lot of people it's hard for people to admit that they're wrong. Cause, Cause you gotta understand. You feel me? The, right is his own wisdom. You feel me? Like by see, see because of their pride. See, see, but a lot of people have pride. People act like if they admit that they're wrong, like, man, they're less of a man. You feel me? Because they take pride in the evil they did. Like, 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 people take pride in doing evil. You feel me? And that's one thing I had to do. You feel me? But, but that's one thing I had to do. I had to get sick and tired. And, bro, you can't do that unless you're sick and tired and tired of being sick and tired. See, see, but what that means is you cannot admit that you're wrong until you're sick and tired and tired of being sick and tired. That means, bro, when, when you're sick and tired of living that lifestyle and you're tired, and, tired of being sick and tired of living that lifestyle. See, what that means is that, bro, when I was doing all that dumb shit, bro, you feel me? I got so sick and tired, you feel me, of, of going in and out of jail. Like, bro, I got so sick and tired of it. Like, bro, like, bro, it's like, it's certain things, like, it's certain times, like, bro, when you do things, bro, like, 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 like bro, when you, when you do evil things, sometimes you get sick and tired of it. Sometimes you want to change. Sometimes when bad things happen for you, I mean, you know how, like, when bad things happen to you constantly, when you get sick and tired of the bad things happening to you, and, you, bro, bro, when you want to change, bro, it's the same way when you're doing bad stuff. Like, 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 right now, I know Trump is tired of sick and tired of everybody, but he's not going to change unless he wants to. See, and that's the thing. And, like, for somebody to want to change, they have been tired of sick and tired of their old ways. You feel me? They must be sick and tired and tired of being sick and tired of living their old lifestyle. You feel me? Their old ways. And if they're not, but, but until you get sick and tired, until you say, I'm sick of this life, I want to change. I want better. You feel me? And you feel me? Until you admit that the life that you live in, that gangster life, you know what I'm saying? That, 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 that hoist life is for women, you know what I'm saying? That got no man, that thuggish life, that street lifestyle, you know what I'm saying? Like, if it's for white for the racist life, lifestyle, you know what I'm saying? Like, if it's for the black folk, all this dumb ass shit niggas do, man, to credit they killing, the killing, and the bullshit, and the fighting, and the brutality. No, 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 I'm saying. Like, like, bro, like, like, bro, like, bro, there, 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 there will not be no change in the community until the people are sick and tired, and tired of being sick and tired, my people. My people, I'm telling you, like, bro, I don't hate y'all. I love y'all. But you have to do it for yourself. Bro, I could talk all day long. I could preach all day long. But until you're ready to do it for yourself. Bro, just like the Bible said, bro, you can mend your, bro, bro, just like the old saying said, I mean, you could lead a horse to the water. Bro, I could teach you all day long, try to lead you into good power. But I could teach you all day long, try to get you to understand this shit. I could bring you down to the simplest understanding. But 
I could lead you to this water, and, and that's what I'm doing, leading you into the path. But like I'm telling you, it's going to take you. It's going to take you. If you're thirsty or no, you're going to get tired. When you're sick and tired of being thirsty, what you do? You be like, fuck this shit. I'm going to pop me some one from the bed down there and drink me that water. You feel me? See that what I'm saying, bro? You have to be sick and tired. But y'all not sick and tired. You like this because, bro, this is your lifestyle. You think this is cool, bro. Bro, you like it because you think it's cool. You, bro, you like it because you think people praise you because the community, because the community and society has made it a norm. Because society has made it a norm and now it's normal to everybody. Y'all need to change this society. Society has to change and they have to change for themselves. Not for me, but because they want to. Not for me, but because they want to and because they see that, that they need to. And until they do that, I'm telling you, there will not be no peace on this land. There will not be no success on this land. Don't, don't, bro, don't all be confusion. And that's what it is. And this is a great country. And, bro, and I can't even imagine how a great country with all this potential and all this talent can be so, so selfish on themselves. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, they rather push a Put a fucked up agenda, you feel me, based on their emotion or their hate, they actually leave in peace. Like, bro, you have to make it, and you have to end this racism. And this racism is what is dividing everybody. You feel me? And it's going to take the white people to end this racism. And if white people don't end racism, there will be no unity in America. <coughs> There will be no unity.